I am so, so excited. I couldn't be more thrilled about this, but your favorite and mine, Dutch Test, has done some updates. Yes, Dutch has actually updated and added some really important nutrient markers to their test. So here we go. This is just a sample. This is just a sample, one that I printed out so I could kind of show you. When we look at the nutrient levels here, they're testing these nutrient levels. Look, they've got some new things added. New things added. So one of the new things I'm gonna talk about today is the biotin marker. Now, why would this be important, right? And who cares about biotin markers? I am Dr. Beth Westy, women's health and hormone expert, author of the books, The Female Fat Solution, The Female Menopause Solution. These are on Amazon. And again, you can learn more about what I do on my YouTube, which is Dr. Beth Westy, so subscribe to that. And my podcast, The Female Health Solution. So talking about your biotin markers is really, really important. Eating protein is the number one way to build your lean muscle tissue. But how do you know that you're getting enough protein for what your body needs and your body's actually absorbing it? This biotin marker, this biotin marker that we can now measure and see. Yes, this marker that we're looking at is actually a breakdown from isoleucine, which is a really important amino acid in your body. And in looking at this marker specifically, we're making sure that your system is one, getting enough protein and able to digest it and absorb it. If you are not getting enough protein, your hormones are going to have a really hard time regulating as well as you almost have no chance in having a good metabolism, right? Because we know basal metabolic rate really, really functions off of a really good metabolism that is dependent on your lean muscle tissue. So when we're looking at this, and there's more information online, I always encourage you to do your own research, but right from Dutch test, right from what we're looking at, this biotin is important. This biotin marker that we're looking at is a really important cofactor in mitochondrial function, right? So how your cells function in metabolism of fatty acids, of glucose, of protein. And it is you know, really important to understand that if you have a biotin deficiency, it actually can mimic other nutrient deficiencies. So it's essential that you learn exactly what your system needs and target those things. That's how you get to and keep the best results possible. So I cannot wait to dive into this with you. If you have not gotten your own Dutch test, if you haven't looked at what your levels are and learned how you can go through this, I mean, go in, the, go in the comments here, right? Make sure you're going in the comments. Get a, your own test sent to you. So easy. You get the test sent to you. You take it at home. You send it into the lab. And then we go over your results, right? We go over your results and make sure you get the right recommendations moving forward to support you in the way that you need. Otherwise, it can be really frustrating to feel like I'm doing all these things. I'm eating healthy. I am, you know, trying to exercise regularly, but I'm not seeing anything different. Well, even if you're eating healthy, you might not be getting enough protein. And that's what this biotin marker tells us. Ooh, I'm going to be talking more about some of the new exciting changes that Dutch has made to their test and how it's important and how it's going to help you just get better results overall. So stay tuned. Make sure you subscribe. You know, click that button right there. And I'm so excited to walk you through this. Now, if you're looking for more assistance with balancing your hormones, remember, I do have my detox support supplement, which is on my website, nutritionforyourhormones.com. Also my estrogen and progesterone tinctures. These are essential for helping balance estrogen and progesterone, helping support that. I've got the adrenal balance, which I can't tell you how many women I've seen improvements on their cortisol and adrenal levels from taking this. It's awesome. And then my metabo boost, which, help, which helps get your metabolism going when it's been a little stagnant. So. That's what I got for you today. Please let me know if you have any questions. Do not hesitate to leave a comment if you have a question. If you're not comfortable commenting, reach out to me personally. I totally understand that. Sometimes the questions that you have, you might not be comfortable commenting. So reach out to me because I'd be more than happy to help move you in the right direction for you.